I come from Western Kenya. I didn't grow up in an elephant environment. This is a different environment. A friend of mine was working at the Shedricks. He kept on pushing if I would join them. But I just considered myself as a clean man. I would all the time be in my suit, a tie, clean, white shirts, and uh, they were wild animals. I considered them to be dirty. Eventually, I ended the job, and I came to learn if we just love them. That is the most important part of it. Infants, they need to be loved. Love is the key to life. And I still even have my old white trousers, my old <laughs> white shirts. But that is not where I belong. This is where I belong. My life is with the elephants. worried about Malikia, but from look of things, Sana Sana seems to be more confused, more worried, more stressed. Uh, Sana Sana is trying to communicate with Indiwa. You see they bring the trunk and then they uh, yeah talking to each other. So she knows she is not alone. So far, so good. She knows even with the noise that is coming from the truck, she is still comfortable, she is still happy that uh, my keepers are around. Maliki has graduated from the nursery. Now she needs to be taught more by this group of elephants, a little bit older than her. And she needs to grow much bigger, stronger enough to defend herself. Okay, guys, here we are. Come on, baby. 
Come out, monkey. Come. Come. Come out. Come out. Good girl. Come. Good girl. Diva. Diva. Here. Okay. Okay. Come on, monkey. Monkey. Flight. <laughs> it is. Long one. Long one. <laughs> you know, it's surprising. Malkia was the best. Really? Malkia was the best. Malkia? 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 Chip, 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 chip. Chip, chip, chip. Here come the others. That's about four months they call five. These three guys they just left Nairobi. Old friends. So it's like, oh, this is where you came, you know, they have such a very perfect memory. You are here, finally. You are here. You see now, the other group is coming and uh, they are all joyous, they are running to them. I'm just trying to sort of imagine what it feels like for them to kind of wake up in Nairobi and, and disembark here. It's a very overwhelming time. As you look out there, there's over 3,000 square kilometers of not a human footprint. So, yeah, very special place for them to call home.